From Channel 3, this is an Eyewitness News update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Nicole Nalepa, and here are your top headlines on this Friday morning, November 6th. The ballot counting is winding down in the presidential race. Last night, the president criticized inaccuracies in polling and even called out Quinnipiac University in Hamden, saying they were, quote, plain wrong in Florida. Now, in a statement, the director of the Quinnipiac University poll said, quote, we stand behind our methodology, and the polling industry provides valuable insights into changing political opinions over time. Unquote. Meanwhile, Connecticut Senator Chris Murphy called out the president for trying to stop those tallies yesterday. These calls to prematurely shut down the vote, but only in the states where he is currently leading without all the votes being counted, is a massive abuse of power. Senator Murphy warned interfering with the vote counting will only incite violence at counting sites. Now we turn to the latest on the coronavirus in Connecticut. Governor Lamont is rolling back the state's reopening plan to 2.1. And due to a surge in positive COVID cases, this is why this is happening. New numbers out from the governor's office show that the state is now at a 3.7% positivity rate. 11 more people have died, and there are currently 380 people in the hospital. Now, as part of this rollback, restaurants will have to limit capacity to 50%, and guests will be asked to leave by 9.30. Takeout will be available after 9.30, though. And they are asking people to work from home as much as possible. There also uh, are some guidelines on a curfew, so you can head to the Channel 3 app for more information on that. Scott? All right, thanks, Nicole. Uh, we are taking a look at sunshine right across the board. Did start off this morning with a little bit of cloud coverage, but look at the sun, 70, 71, 72 possible today. Temperatures along the shoreline are going to make it into the mid to upper 60s with golden sunshine there. Wow, what a day, becoming sunny and warm. Uh, we had a little fog this morning. That's burning off. The sun is coming out, and it's going to stick around for the entire weekend. 74 degrees Saturday, Sunday, Monday, 75, Tuesday, 72. Maybe a little rain on Wednesday, and then back to the dry weather on Thursday. A little bit cooler on Thursday, but 65 for this time of year. That's still 10 degrees above average. Have a great day and a great weekend, everyone. Thanks for watching. Eyewitness News is everywhere. Get the latest in-depth headlines anytime on the Channel 3 streaming news app.